Hey y'all, I just spent a few hours doing some meal prep for back to school and also some lunches. So I wanna take a few seconds and show you what I did. You wanna show them what we did? Okay. So here is my back to school uh, prep work and also my meals for the work week as well. So I'm gonna go through real quick and show you what I've done. So over here I have some ham and cheese, turkey and cheese, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, and I will freeze these. And then in the morning, I just pull them out of the freezer, put them in my daughter's lunchbox, and they are good to go. And by the time she eats lunch, they're thawed, they're perfectly, um, you know, they're perfectly great, and she loves them. And then over here, I have some strawberries and blueberries. I showed these in my recent haul video. So I just put those in portion containers and I use that for myself on my lunch weeks and also for the pancakes that I made, uh, which I'll show you in a second. And then over here, I have a bunch of chips for, um, for my daughter. You know, she takes the chips with her. Um, I myself take the chips for my soup that I will show you in just a second. I also like chips and salsa just as a snack at home. So I just put these in little portion bags. So whole lot of chips right there. And then over here, I have some apples, same apples that I showed in my haul video. So I just cored those, sliced them up real fast. And then if you notice, there's a little liquid in them right there. I don't know if you can see that. And that is pineapple juice rather than uh, lemon juice, which can be a little bit sour. Pineapple juice is a great alternative to, um, to keep the apple cores from turning brown. Um, so that's a great little tip right there. And then I have some oranges over here ready for her to grab. So um, these were in my recent HEB haul video. No prep work or anything, just took them out of the box. These are just some squeezable applesauce. And her school um, uses these caps. They reuse the caps for some reason. Um, so, you know, no prep work. She just grabs these and go. And then over here, I have some different sandwiches with French bread because we are going on a end of the summer picnic so we have some sandwiches there for that tomorrow i've got some shredded cheese portioned out for my soup that i'll show you in just a second so that's for my lunches over here i've got some grapes some more fruit that she can just grab and put in her lunch box over here is her treat bucket she has some oreos in there that she and she did these. She put the Oreos in the snack bag. She did the grapes. She did the chips. So great tip. If you've got, you know, kids, put them to work. My daughter's only seven and she already knows what to do um, with her lunch prep. And then we also have some pudding over there. And then over here I have some pancakes that I made up. I'm going to leave the recipe in the description box. And the great thing about homemade pancakes is you can... Uh, whip them up, put them in the freezer, pop them in the toaster, just like an Eggo waffle in the morning, and they're good to go. And then over here, I have some snacks for me, some salsa, because I love chips and salsa, some green beans I had left over, so I'll use those, you know, just, I don't want to waste any food, so I'd rather put them in these little jars and pop them in the microwave at work. And then I found this bag of Greek yogurt dried craisins, which I love these, and I completely forgot that I had them in my pantry. So I just put those in little containers as well, a little treat for myself. And then this is my lunch uh, for the week. This is Budget Girls Taco Soup. I will leave a link to her video in the description bar. Um, and she talks about the recipe. It's really, really easy to do. You just brown up some ground meat, throw beans, corn, um, salsa, or Rotel all in the crock pot, cook it for a few hours, and then you just put them in these mason jars and you've got lunch for the week. So that is my prep work for back to school and for the week. I think I did awesome. It did, I'm not gonna lie, it did take me some time to do all of this. Um, I started about three and it's about six o'clock right now. So it did take me about three hours to do all this, but it's gonna save me a mountain of time in the morning and then throughout the week. And this is probably a, at least the first month of school's worth of uh, meals. So we should be good for a while. Thanks so much. Bye. Can I get a kiss? Can I have a kiss? No, on my cheek?
Mommy get a kiss. Aw, thank you. <laughs> I'm tired, y'all.